Oh, top of the morning to you, Lottie. <laughs> top of the morning to you. And to you, top of top of the evening. Um, I don't know. There, there's a thing that you say after someone says top of the morning to you. But I forgot what it was. There's like a, another response there that I missed out on. Anywho, uh, today is Thursday, yeah? We made it to this point in the week. Um, this is not a live stream, this is just a straight video recording. Um, I'm sick of, what is it called? Uh, slob destroying all of my quality to try to live stream. So, <clears throat> I'm just gonna use the live stream scheduler. I know it's cheating. I know it's cheating. And it's like, oh, no, don't do that. It's cheating. And then it's not really live and you can't interact with us. Um, on the mobile phone, I don't usually interact too much with the audience either way. So I figured not such a big deal to do a live stream pre-recorded, you know? But it, if, if it is a big deal, if you guys enjoy the live stuff, Mo better, you know, just let me know. I noticed that Restream.io is not putting out all, I don't know if it's a problem with Restream or, or some of my, my uh, stream keys have changed. It's not putting out my streams everywhere. Um, I noticed that DLive is getting neglected now. Sometimes it does, uh, you know, stream to DLive, sometimes it doesn't. Oh uh, boy, school's back in session. Let's drive slow, guys. Drive slow. Oh man, I forgot about school. Uh, I should've never went this way. I should've went the other way. But whichever's. We're here now, right? Home here now. So, what did I really want to talk about? Uh, school's back in session, you know? You gotta drive slow. Let's drive all this slowness. Oh yeah, we's going slow. Ooh, look at me, I'm so slow. Protecting all the kids. All right, and there's the end of the school zone. <laughs> I guess it's not so bad on this road. Um, what does the guy say about all the, the stuffs? There, there was a point to this. I wanted to talk about, like, everybody and their grandma already talked about it, but let's talk about Jeff Epstein and the Pizzagate and the, all that stuff. Pizzagate was right, okay? Uh, there is, you know, secret pedophile, you know, circles where they are trafficking people. So you guys laughed and kikied at P P Pizzagate because they had a silly name. But, you know, just shit, shit's real. Um, uh, and I'm not a huge conspiracy person. You know, I believe in the, the basics, you know, the basic ones. Um, if a government is to profit, you know, following the money trail is real easy. No brainer way to, to look at it. Like, who profited off of 9-11? Um... Well, directly, it was the people that were awarded the big contracts that, uh, you know, the vice president at the time was, uh, what was that guy's name? They had a movie about him. Uh, damn, he shot his friend in the face. I cannot not remember this guy's name now. Brain farts. It's an AM blog, you know. Dick Cheney. Boom! Came out of the noggin. I was, I was, I had to think about it, and then, then the words came out. <laughs> Bad people in my brain, Dick Cheney. Um, <laughs> so yeah, I remembered his name. Uh, that was like a president ago, you know? Wow. So yeah, Dick Cheney did 9/11. I don't think Bush was. He even knew about it. They didn't even tell Bush about it. 
maybe they did. Maybe that's why he was at, like, uh, elementary school at the time. They told him about it. And he was like, well, what make me look really is if I read books upside down to a bunch of kids? <laughs> Who knows, though? Who knows? Um, so, yeah, his, his buddies, uh, Dick Cheney's buddies, directly profited off of 9-11. So that's a, like a no-brainer. Um, they got their forever war, and they wanted that for a long time, the military industrial complex. And that's cool, they got that. Um, so yeah, I believe in like conspiracies like that because they make sense to my brain. Like the math is there. Uh, if someone's directly profiting off of that and is in that height of command, and if, yeah, of course they but, um, let's see, as far as, uh, have we been to the moon? Probably not. That's just my opinion. Um, and if we have been, I would love to see, like, you know, with my own eyeballs, uh, photos of the junk that we left on the moon. Like, a real, not even a photo. I want to see, like, through a telescope, like, that's live, <laughs> uh, like, all the junk on the moon, but here's the deal, nowadays with, you know, augmented reality being so great, it'd be hard to even trust a, a telescope, like, you look at it, like, oh, man, do I kind of trust this, but who knows, um, I don't, I don't think the moon landing was a, a legit the, the thing that we looked at in the 60s, that footage, I don't think that's legit. Uh, you know, you leave me comments if you disagree. Let's see what other... Like, I don't believe in, like, aliens. And that might be, a, like, a, a weird one for a lot of people. Like, oh, what? You don't believe in aliens? Well, not the way that they're portrayed in, in media. Let's say it that way. Um, I do believe there are outside forces that are manipulating um, people, you know? Manipulating people. Outside forces, not, not so much extraterrestrial as far as the spiritual realm, you know? So what you might consider an alien when you're on ayahuasca, I might consider a demon, you know. Any hoots. It is what it is, right? Let's see. What other things did we want to talk about? I wanted to talk about um, Epstein, right? Everyone's talking about that dude. And they're like, oh, yeah, body count this, body count that. Like... It is possible that he killed himself, right? And that they also happened to lose the video for hours and took him off suicide watch right before? And uh, maybe, maybe, maybe did. <laughs> Um, and they also fudged the numbers when supposed to be checking on them every half hour. They're just like, eh, whatever. <laughs> Most important uh, prisoner that we'll ever see, you know, in the history of the U.S. justice system. <laughs> yeah, we checked on him. <laughs> uh, that's federal prison, guys. That is not even like... That's not like the jail cell, the holding jail cell where they they keep in jaywalkers. This is a federal jail or prison. And whoopsie doopsies, right? Um, you know, he's still a person at the end of the day, and you gotta treat him as such, even if he was, you know, a bad person. Good and bad. Come on, it's not that easy. It's not that simple. But at the end of the day, I think a lot less people will mourn for him. Um, 
because of, you know, his actions. If you're going to, like, have, be a shitty person for the most of your life, um, don't expect people to give a crap when you pass. Um... So yeah, we did it. We talked about it. Um, do I think? Like, here's the deal. Dude had DVDs and DVDs, racks on racks on racks, of just people's names and being like, this person's name, Young. So he probably has lots of, you know, footage of, you know, blackmail. He probably has tons of blackmail. Will those, will the PP tapes ever get out? Probably not. They're probably being destroyed as we speak by um, intelligence agencies. Uh, you know, <laughs> just kind of silly. Uh, why not open an investigation for every DVD? <sighs> That's not, that's not how the people in power, it's not how it operates, right? So, yeah, he had a lot of influential, you know, powerful people. What I'd use air quotes because, like, what is a powerful person? Come on, guys. We're all just people. Um, About people that are, like, in high positions. Uh, let's say that. Like, people that are, you know, government leaders or diplomats or, you know, whatever's other billionaires. That dude had a lot of dirt on a lot of people. In the end, <laughs> and the silly thing is he got, I don't know, he had bruises all around his neck before, so it was like, oh, come on. Uh, hang yourself once, shame on, shame on you. Hang yourself twice. Shouldn't hang yourself anymore. <laughs> I'm making jokes, but like, it, it is a serious thing suicide and all that. But I don't think he suicided. I think he. Uh, somebody, you know, urged him or encouraged him or even helped him get the job done. That's even if, like, I want to see bodies. I want to see evidence that this guy, like, the videotape missing thing is, I don't know, the dude might be back at Pinfile Island as we speak. And nobody would be the wiser. Uh, well, they said they have a coroner and that it, the, the thing was undetermined? It wasn't, ran, like, the coroner said it was pending. What the? What the? What does that even mean? Pending? Like, did you not do your job? Like, why is it pending? The cause of death. Is the body still missing? <laughs> is that why it's pending? Like, I can't sign off on this. So I have no body. Uh, pending. <laughs> But, um, yeah, if they, if we wanted to, we live in such a world of surveillance, you know, that it would be qu quite easy to have no secret sex, you know, that could end, you know, that's something that we could do, I mean, you know, the FBI released, like, Who's the other guy that was like mad into the the pedophile craps? It was like everyone surrounding the Clintons. It's, it's weird, but uh, yeah, don't, people are trying to like make this a left or a right thing, and it's not like people on the left and the right. Like it's just people of power, you know. They all make trips to Pedophile Island. 
you know, Trump's been there too, guys. So don't get all worked up saying, oh yeah, those damn liberal pedophiles. Because <laughs> it's more than it's more than just that. It's not like pedophilia isn't a left or a right issue. And don't try to make it one. Because then it's just stupid. So either ways, uh, nice little chat, talked about suicide, pedophiles, and uh, the whatnots. Um, is there anything else I wanted to talk to you guys about? Yeah, I don't know. I'll do it this format. I'm a little too zoomed into my face, but whatever. I'll do it this format if it's better, you know, as far as the quality and the whatnot, and you can understand what I'm saying. Um, the, the one advantage is that it's not constantly cutting out. Um, I, the signal in Miami Gardens, for some reason, is horrible. So I really can't do the live stream and chat. And Like, if I have a different... If I had a different route that I took that wasn't through Miami Gardens, <laughs> then yeah, maybe, but this is how I have to get there. So, it is what it is. Um, yeah, my 4G just doesn't cut it as far as the, the live streaming goes. You know, I'd like to, like, yeah, live streaming, cool. Oh, oh. Super important, cool, hip. So check out any of my socials. Uh, what I mean, any my Twitter or my my Facebookies, because I have posted affiliate links to. Where did I post affiliate links to? Oh, BitTubers. So check them out. Um, it's a video sharing platform. Also. Uh, image sharing, also audio sharing. And this is why I think all all social media should handle it as far as having the three musketeers together. So you have video, audio, uh, image. And I think that's the, the, the perfect combo as far as sharing media. Um, so it's very friendly to podcasts. I don't know if there's a limit on the audio portion. I know there is a limit on the video portion. Just That's just, you know, that would just make sense. Like, yeah, if you upload a nine-hour video every day, you're going to bog down somebody's server. Right? And everybody and their grandma has a podcast nowadays. <laughs> Uh, need to hear them talk four hours about the new Pokemon. <laughs> Sounds like a podcast I would listen to. Uh, either ways, I'm going to cut this, you know, before the 20 minute mark here. So we don't want to ramble for 20 minutes straight. Or do we? I don't know. Maybe we do. Either way, I'm going to cut it off here, guys. Enjoy your day, enjoy your weekend, Where, whenever you watch this, you know, do you, um, stay true. Uh, what other good advice can I give? Yeah, don't be a shitty person, and, you know, be nice to people. Alright, peace out.